Hi everyone, my name is Richard and I'm happy to show you our new app VoiceFlow for Mac. Uh, so yeah, let's, let's jump right in. The topic here is basically just how to create a connection because all the things you're going to do with it is basically up to you. Um, currently the app focuses on the knowledge base APIs um, so you can manage that effectively and automatically through make.com but uh, yeah going forward uh, we might extend the functionality I don't know let's see so um, at this stage we assume that you've already bought the app that you received the email from us with the installation link clicked on it um, then I think you're jumping into the dashboard of your uh, make instance you go into a scenario and you search for voice flow um, then you you go into it and say okay create a knowledge base tag just as I did and that's basically where we're at right, right now so if you click on create a connection you will see that you need an API key and an app, uh, app access code we will rename this into license key uh, but it's still the same um, so yeah the the license key or the app access code is in our email um, for me i will do an easy one it's one two three four um, for the voice flow api key you need to jump into voice flow so this is the um, yeah the dashboard go into the project uh, let me move this here go into integration api keys and copy this obviously it's it's a bad uh, yeah, bad practice to reveal this API key. So never do that. I will just revoke my API key shortly after. Um, yeah, and that's basically it. So now we have a, a connection. Ideally, you name it properly. Um, I, I didn't do that here. And now we can simply create an, a, a, a test here, a test label. Et voila, we do have a new um, tag for, uh, for our knowledge base. So um, yeah, currently, as I said, it's, it's really around the knowledge base. So we do have the tags here, deleting, updating, creating, and also the documents. Um, we might get into the other functionalities as well, but we do have the make an API call, uh, which hopefully helps you uh, for functionality, which is not built out yet in the app. So yeah, I hope you enjoy it. And uh, if you do have any questions, please let us know. Bye-bye.